Testing a 1961, 62, 63 Cadillac headlight switch, non fog light option, serial number HS1118 2023, offered by TT Parts Rebuilding. Run up test. Test number one, tail and parking light operation. Test number two, tail and headlight operation. Test number three, dash lights set low to high. Test number four, dome courtesy light operation. Test number five, circuit breaker test. Test number six, switch terminals insulated from ground. The run up test will be using a fully charged battery. I'm going to be boosting the battery during the run up test. Right now we're reporting 12.93. Now show 13.92 volts. Also going to be monitoring the rheostat temperature. Right now we're at ambient at 81 degrees. Test number one, tail and parking light operation. First position, we have the tail lights, front parking, and dash lights. We'll just set those to low and off. Again, first position, tail and parking, tail lights, parking, dash lights, and off. Test number two, tail and headlight operation. First position, we have front parking, tail lights. Second position, front parking lights are off, headlights are on. Back to first position, headlights off, front parking lights come back on and off. Test number three, dash lights set low to high. First position, going to rotate the rheostat to low and off position for the head, for the dash lights. We go to mid range, and we see we have a little increase in temperature in the rheostat. To high, full bright, back to mid range. To low, off, back to mid range, second position, headlights are on, front parking lights are off, dash lights, we're going to set those to low, mid range, full, back to mid range, to low, and off. And off, back to mid range, back to first position, and off. Test number four dome courtesy light operation. First position, going to rotate the rheostat, ground the switch terminal contact. It's indication of dome courtesy light. Off, on, second position. Dome light off, dome light on. First position, dome light off, switch off. Feature is available with the switch off. See, we can turn on the dome courtesy lights by rotating the control knob and grounding the switch body tab. Test number five circuit breaker test. Elko Remy headlight switches had an onboard circuit breaker. I'm a contact arm connected the battery terminal to the switch bodies. In the event of a short in the vehicle, contact arm would overheat and break the circuit back to the battery. To demonstrate that, we're going to put it in first position and simulate an overheating of the contact arm. And we see that the switch now is disconnected from the battery. Also, try that in second position. Overheating of the contact arm protects the switch in the vehicle wiring circuit is broken back to the battery. Back to first position, overheating of the contact arm, and off. Test number six, switch terminals insulated from ground. Using a standard 12 volt test light, you see we have continuity back to the battery, touching the switch chassis. I'm going to probe each terminal and demonstrate that the switch terminals are insulated from ground. We have our dash light, Battery feed, headlights, tail lights, parking light, dome courtesy light 
ground tab. You see that we have no continuity back to the battery at the switch body terminals. Only back to the battery continuity we have is at the chassis itself. This demonstrates that the switch terminals are insulated from ground.